Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new to this channel, my name is Amra and this is Amra's Beauty Blog. I'm a freelance makeup artist with a passion for all things beauty. If you're a subscriber, then a welcome return. If you like this video, then please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell for weekly uploads. So today I'm going to be doing a video on Beauty Pie. I haven't done a haul or an unboxing of Beauty Pie in a short while, so I thought I would show you what I picked up. This is the Beauty Pie box that it comes in. I am a member and I'm still considering whether or not to stop my membership or not because I don't know whether I'm buying enough from them to be a member but that's another story. Anyhow I've picked up some pieces for the summer so let's have a look. This is the box and we'll open it together so it comes in this lovely wrapping. This time around they gave me a sample. So I have a sample of, I think it's a chocolate collagen drink. Looks like that. You can smell the chocolate coming out and I'm looking forward to trying this. It says cholagen, which is chocolate and collagen, I'm guessing, combined into one. So I'll definitely try this out. So just before I start, I have their foundation on because I just wanted to show you that they do foundation as well at Beauty Pie. This is their Great Skin Foundation and I have this in the colour Medium 500 Sand. So this is my colour, as you can see it's a great colour match and yeah, this is what I have on. I also have some brow just because we're going to be doing a look together today. So these are the items that I've got inside this lovely travel case. It came in a Beauty Pie pouch which is really lovely, great for storage, and it's a drawstring, really, really nice. But I'm sure you wanna know what's in here, so let's take a look together. So, I bought the Holly kit. So, Holly Willoughby is a British TV presenter, and she did a collaboration with Beauty Pie. These are her picks of a summer look that would suit all skin tones. So, as part of her kit, you get this lovely travel case, which I'm definitely gonna be using. This is a see-through case, very similar to what Space and K do, but this is in rose gold. So, it's a lovely rose gold zip, going all the way round. The quality is really, really good. And you see Beauty Pie, which is just written here. So I really love this. You get four items. You get the Beauty Pie, the perfect waterproof mascara. This is what the packaging looks like. It's so pretty. It's rose gold and it's waterproof, pro vitamin B5. It says here with acacia seed peptide. You get eight mil of product. You also get in here a lip product, which is a Shine Up Luxe Lip Color Balm. It's a three in one balm, plant oil formula, lipo filling effect. And I'll show you the color. So this is like a universal shade and it's called Hello Petal and this is made in Italy. The mascara is made in Korea. Then you also get a blush product. This is a Gleam, sort of super cheek Gleam blush and it is in the colour Gleam Me Up which is quite appropriate. It's sheer and radiant, pearlescent pigments, hyaluronic acid infused. Tap a tiny amount of product onto cheeks wherever you naturally blush. Then add layers to build as much color as you want and blend. This one is also made in Italy. So this one has five grams of product. It's in a really pretty color. This is Gleam Me Up. It's a lovely shade there. Then the final item in Holly's edit is the Deluxe Eyeshadow Quad. I picked this up because I bought the James Malloy ones and I was really impressed with the pigmentation and I believe this is made in Italy as well so I think the pigmentation should just be as good. So it's Beauty Pie Deluxe Eyeshadow Quad, long wear, buttery and high pigment and you get 1.1 grams of product times four in each pan. So this is what it looks like. So these are the shades. You can see that these shades are ultra wearable, which is beautiful. You also get a mirror. So I'm just gonna pull this off because I'm gonna use this mirror when we're doing the makeup. So very nice to get a mirror. And these are the colors. And this is the makeup bag close up. I forgot to mention that the bag is made in China. 
So while I was on the Beauty Pie website, I decided to purchase a few new launches as well. They've just released their awesome bronze, gorgeous Sunkiss bronzing cream. And when I was looking at the photographs, this was the color that closely matched my skin tone according to the models that they had on the website. It's a sheer satin finish, cream to powder bronzer, sculpting, shading, and shaping. This one's in the color Soleil All Day. So I'll just show you how that looks. This very much reminds me of the Chanel bronzer. So what I will do is at the end of this video, I'm just gonna do a quick comparison with my Chanel one. But I just wanted to show you what this one looks like. This one is also made in Italy, and this one has 30 grams of product. So you can see the container here. You twist the top, very similar to the Chanel one that you're probably all familiar with. So this is really interesting to see how they compare. So I also picked up a new launch of theirs and it's their Pro Bronzer and Contour Brush. As I had bought the bronzer, I thought it would be a good idea to try their brush alongside it. This is super soft fibres, 100% cruelty free and vegan. For a naturally seamless finish, use the smaller brush to apply a cream blush or bronzer, then the larger end to blend out. So I'm going to definitely try that technique. So this is what the brush looks like. You've got a part here which is the part to blend with it's almost like a stripling brush at the top because it has sort of that sort of feeling and that look and then on the bottom part it's a lot more controlled it's a smaller brush and that will help when you're trying to contour where you need it to go and then you can just use the other side to just buff it in and get it how you want it to look. And then finally, because I had seen the Super Cheek that had been launched, they also launched another color, which is in the color Astro Pink. This has exactly the same amount of product as the other one, it's just a different color. And I like this one because it's a little bit more of a pop to it. So what I might do is use the first one and then I might add and layer this one on top because I think with my skin tone, this is probably gonna pop a little bit more and look really nice on camera. So that is how the color looks. So what I'm gonna do is, I've already got my foundation on and we're literally gonna do a look together. I'm gonna to start with the eyeshadow, move on to the bronzer, then the blush, then the lip, and kind of add some mascara along the way with a little bit of liner just to get the look sort of nice and finished. As we go along, I'll also do some hand swatches and arm swatches as well. And at the end of the video, I'll try and do some comparisons for the cream bronzer with the Chanel one, because I think that's the one that looks most like this one. And then I'll give you my final thoughts on what I've picked up. Okay, so here are the shades, and I'm just gonna quickly do a arm swatch with you. So we'll start off the first shade here, and then we'll move across like that. formula is very nice. Wow, that's really surprised me. Oh, was not expecting that at all. That is gorgeous. Looks so much better once you swatch it, actually. That feels like a really lovely base. Wow, I'm just so surprised at how pigmented this is. I'm just gonna blend this out with a brush.
that's really nice. So I'm just gonna line the eyes with that dark brown color. It's really pigmented. It's really lovely actually, the color is really great for my skin tone. Lovely. And then, I, and then I think I'm gonna take this topper shade, I'm just gonna use my ring finger to put this on because it will pick up the color better. Oh, that's pretty. It's really nice. And then I'm gonna use this color here as an inner corner shade. So I've just gone away and I've added some liner. So this is the perfect waterproof mascara. So I'm just gonna pull it out. You've got the brush, which kind of looks a bit spirally actually. And we're gonna put this on. Okay, so I've just added some mascara. Definitely this has added some volume to my lashes. So this is the eye look so far with the mascara and liner. So I just wanted to show you the bronzer and before I put this on, I am going to do you a hand swatch. Okay, so let's do a hand swatch. It's definitely more on the warmer side, so it's definitely a bronzer, not a contour. So this is the brush. and then we're gonna use the tip. And I'm gonna dip that into here. So I'm gonna take this and use the tip of the brush and we're gonna go in and basically put the bronzer here and then we're gonna blend it out. Hmm, very nice. So now I'm gonna take the Gleam Me Up Super Cheek Blush. We're gonna use that first and then I'm gonna go in with my other blush to layer, but we'll start off with the one that Holly has selected. So before I do that, I'll just do a quick hand swatch with you. So this is the hand swatch. Oh, that's pretty. So I'm gonna try and apply it with my finger first, and I'm just gonna do it on the apples of my cheeks. You can see already it's got this lovely highlighting effect, so it's like a two-in-one blush highlighter. It's very clever. It's gorgeous. Now I'm gonna go in with this deeper color and this one's called Astro Pink. First I'll swatch it for you. It's 
So we're just going to do a hand swatch. That's a nice pink. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add this colour on top of this one. Mm, that's pretty. So this is the final item we're going to use. This is the Shine Up Luxe Lip Colour Balm. And it's in the colour Hello Petal. I'm just going to do a hand swatch for you first. So this is the hand swatch. It's a nice colour. So let, okay, so let's add the lip to finish this look off. So this balm is really lovely. I can feel it hydrating my lips as I put it on. And with this look, it really completes the look and gives it a really summery feel. This is the finished look. So I'm so happy with this look. It's such a pretty, summery inspired look. So this is what I thought this one reminded me of, which is the Chanel Le Beige Healthy Glow Bronzing Cream. I've got this in Soleil Tan Deep. We're gonna compare these two. Okay, so I'm just gonna show you the two arm swatches side by side. This is the Beauty Pie one, which is the Soleil All Day one. And this is the Chanel one, 395 Soleil Tan Deep Bronze Shade. Now what has first shocked me is they are really similar in colour. In fact, if I had this on my face, I don't think you'd be able to tell which one was on my face because they are that similar. So if you look at both of them, even though this one looks larger, they actually contain the same amount of product. So there's 30 grams in here and there's 30 grams in here. But this one works out a lot cheaper. So I'm going to put the prices below. And actually, this could be a really good deal or a nice dupe for the Chanel Soleil Tan Deep Bronze. So I definitely would consider it for that. And the formulas are not that much different. And I just wanted to show you side by side blended because I think you can see that they are almost identical in colour. I've blended it out just to show you on my skin tone, but I was really surprised that they are almost identical. So this is the finished look and it is so pretty. I was really surprised because I wasn't sure how this was gonna look. Holly is Caucasian and she obviously has a fair skin tone and on her it looked really pretty but I was like, what is it gonna look like on my skin tone? And honestly, I just had a compliment from my husband and I always find that when he makes a compliment it means that the product is appearing really well on the actual camera and I must say that I'm really, really impressed with this. It was a bit of a buy it and see situation because with Beauty Pie, you can't actually try any of their swatches 
or anything like that because they don't have a stand alone store it works by a membership so you join and i pay by year and then i can order products but they're basically cutting out the middleman and all the sort of packaging and everything that's around products you're getting it for cheaper and so it's a really good incentive if you're looking for particular products that are quite similar in terms of dupes but has the same effect like I didn't think that that bronzer would look as well as the Chanel one but looking at my face I love the look that it's achieved and I think that it's a really good dupe so that's really surprised me today the mascara was fine I mean obviously it, it did lift my eyelashes I don't know if it's the best mascara I've tried I love this lip balm though this lip balm is really lovely really hydrating and also buildable as well as the blushes as well it's got that highlighting effect which is like a really good two-in-one product so i think this is really good for holiday because you don't have to worry about carrying too many products with you and you can multitask so i'm definitely thinking about carrying this when i go away for like a sunny week somewhere and i want a bronze look and something that can be done really quickly and doesn't take too much product basically to achieve the look so love it love the eyeshadows as well like i said i've picked up the eyeshadows from beauty pie in the past and the pigmentation is really really good i'm actually thinking that the eyeshadows may be made in the same factory as either pat mcgrath or charlotte tilbury because the packaging is quite similar to charlotte tilbury and the pigmentation is similar as well as sort of the pat mcgrath eyeshadow so i'm quite impressed with that as well the brush was really good because i was able to kind of get it to where i wanted to and then i could blend it out with the larger size brush so very very happy with that as well so yeah that is the finished look so i hope you enjoyed it i am going to be away on holiday for a couple of weeks so i won't be filming but i will try and post videos that i haven't posted so you can see and when i get back i'll be back to filming again for now i will see you in a couple of weeks Please don't forget to leave your comments. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Thank you.